Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Being the Odds. It is Friday, May 19th, 2023, and we are back with our NBA best bets of the day. If you're new to the channel, my name is Zach, and welcome to Being the Odds. Hit that subscribe button, like this video, hit the notification bell so you never miss a pick. We post the NBA videos every single day, along with the NHL and MLB. Both those videos are live right now, so definitely go check those out. Uh, we're going after our first 7,500 subscribers, so I'm really excited to have you all here. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. So to recap yesterday's results, we only had the Nuggets minus 5.5. We got hooked. Nuggets won by five there. They're up by 12 with like six minutes left. Couldn't close the deal. Jamal Murray missed a big free throw at the end. Tough loss, but sometimes those happen. We're 282 and 237 for the year. We're 45 games over 500 for the season so far. Um, so I feel pretty good at where we are. So we have one pick today in the NBA. We have one. Now, I might be adding some player props a little bit later. I actually, I have, there's a few that I really like. I just want to get the final lines out because Sapandul hasn't gotten all the lines out as I'm recording this right this second. Um, but our bet that we're going to do today, I'm gonna, I want to preface it with this. Gambling is war. Sports betting is war, and sports betting and gambling takes balls. And this is the ballsiest pick I can do after what happened two nights ago. We're going Boston minus 8.5. Now, to be clear, I'm not a Boston sports fan. And for my friends who know me, I'm actually more like a Boston sports hater. Like, I don't, I don't like Boston teams. But the easy pick here is Miami. The obvious pick here is Miami. How on earth is it possible that Miami beats Boston at home, out coaches them, out strategizes them. Jason Tatum looks like he's never played basketball before. And the spread on game one was minus seven and a half, and now it's minus eight and a half. That's that's absurd. And I'm guessing by now probably it's like more like minus nine. The fact is, is that I've seen this I've seen this story before. I've seen it before. It was the Philly in Philly in game two. Philly wins a game that they that, that they that were Doc Rivers outcoached Missoula. And Jason Tatum looked like a shell of himself. Jalen Brown was taking ill-advised shot. Like everything that happened in game one for Miami. And then Philly comes back. They have they're instead of plus nine, they're plus ten and a half. Joel Embiid comes back, and you're like, oh my God, Philly's gonna cover this spread. And then Boston wins by 30. Now, here's the deal. I think for the series, I mean, if I'm being honest, I think I think Miami probably wins the series. I don't think they sweep them though. I don't think that Boston's gonna go down and get absolutely blown out at home. And the Celtics have more talent. Like, like let's be very real here. The Celtics have more talent than the Heat do. Jimmy Butler's just the alpha of alphas, and he's fantastic, and I love watching Jimmy play. But the Celtics are not going down 0-2 today. They're gonna bounce back. Jason Tam looked like shit in game one. He will bounce back. Um, and Joe Mazzula, I'm sure. Or, I mean, at least I hope, for God's sake, your NBA coach is going to have a better. It's going to have a better game plan to stop Jimmy Butler because that second half was atrocious. So the sharp money, by the way, is on the Celtics right now. Just so you guys know, right now, 88 as as I'm recording. So again, if you're if you're watching this at three o'clock, things may have changed a little bit. But as I was recording, 88 percent of the bets were on uh, Miami. Only 60 percent of the money was on Miami. That's a big, 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 big de deal, and that's a reverse line movement. I'm rolling with the ball. I'm rolling with boss here. Mine's 8.5. I like him here. And like I said, we might be adding some player props here and there. Members, you'll have those texts straight to you. Everybody else, you can check my Twitter. My Twitter is in the description below, but the members, you will get that early. Um, and by the way, do you become a member? Uh, click the link below in the comments at zdmbets.com slash picks. As a member, you support me and support the channel. It's like $1.50 a day uh, to support me and support the channel. Um, and as a member, you get all of our picks early, way before these videos come out, which will help you a ton with early line movements as well as more better odds. All of our add-on picks are texted straight to you. We, we added the Yankees yesterday, easy winner there. And on top of that, you have a direct line of me. So any game you're considering betting, you can text this. You can text the number that texts you, and you'll get a guaranteed response back. Get a guaranteed response back uh, before game time. And we have some other perks as well, so check out the website below. Uh, so it's zdmbets.com slash picks. So to recap, we have Boston minus 8.5 today. We might be adding some player props here and there. So check my Twitter for that. Remember to give us text it to you. So let's go lock in those picks. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. And I will see you all tomorrow. Make sure I'll check out those other videos.